Oaks from Erja Mountain Athens, Town Oges, Cotlaches, Pas, Tukaya, Portum, Port Oakshire, Yakmatoch, Noam Chichoy, E. Munt, Tetrapanakich. I raise my hands to all of you here. Those words come from my Kukpa, my grandfather, who gave me my name, Chegajimu. My given name is Takaya Blaney. I'm from the Tla'alman Nation. I'm from the Salish Sea. My lands and waters are under the genocidal illegal occupation of the Canadian government, resource extraction industries, and international corporations that are bleeding us dry of our birthright. The salmon, the cedars, the soil. Climate change bleeds us of our birthright. But climate change is merely a symptom of the most significant destructive force responsible for taking our lands and lives every day, and that is colonialism. <laughs> Myself and all my relatives here have been criminalized, surveilled, and experienced violence at the hands of the police, at the hands of RCMP, and injunctions issued by our colonial governments to remove us from our lands when we get in the way of profit. I came here to witness the same Canadian politicians that sanction Indigenous genocide, land dispossession, and extractive projects without free, prior, and informed consent at an international forum for climate. I witnessed Justin Trudeau pose for pictures with Indigenous land defenders. Meanwhile, land defenders are taken as political prisoners back home. COP26 is a performance. It's an illusion constructed to salvage capitalist economies rooted in resource extraction and colonialism. I didn't come here to fix the agenda, I came here to disrupt it.
We can't get too comfortable within these systems. We can't get too comfortable at COP26. We need to be fighting for COP26 to be obsolete. Thank you. 